Stephen Hurahan here at BrandMasterAcademy.com and in this video you're going to learn the difference between taglines and slogans, specifically the why, when and how to use these different strategic branding tools. Stick around. Now, although branding and marketing are two very different beasts, they are used interchangeably at times. And the reason for this is that they share the same overarching goal, and that is to attract and nurture clients to ultimately grow a business and grow the reputation of the brand. But make no mistake about it, branding and marketing are two very, very different beasts. They each have their own specific goals, their own specific tasks, and very specific tools that they use to get the jobs done. And the slogan and the tagline are a perfect example of that. So it is really important that you understand the difference between branding and marketing and you understand the specific tools used for each so you can go out and use them effectively. So let's start with the tagline and have a look at the definition and the role the tagline plays. The definition of a tagline is the memorable formation of a concise set of words which capture the unique value a brand offers its audience. So what your tagline is doing therefore and the role that it's playing is to help your audience to understand what difference your brand makes in the marketplace, what value you bring to the table or what's the big idea that you want associated with your brand. Essentially your tagline therefore is helping your brand to solidify a position in the marketplace. So how does that differ from the slogan? Well, let's take a look at the definition of the slogan. A slogan is a memorable and catchy phrase which captures the overarching theme and value of a marketing campaign. So the key difference is in the association here. The tagline supports the overall goals of the brand, while the slogan supports the overall goals of the marketing and specific marketing campaigns. And they could include branding messages, product or service messages as well. So the job of the slogan is to communicate key differences of the marketing campaign, which could include anything from features to benefits to a key difference of that specific campaign or an overarching idea. And essentially the slogan helps the audience to remember what the key idea is of that specific campaign. And this campaign obviously supports the overall branding message. So the fundamental difference then between the tagline and the slogan is that the tagline supports the branding activities, whereas the slogan supports the marketing activities. The tagline is developed as a means to communicate the difference that the brand is going to offer in the marketplace from a holistic brand point of view, whereas the slogan is developed as a means to communicate the difference and the idea of specific marketing campaigns. And that could be around the overall branding message, the product or the services that the brand offers. Another key difference between the two is in the lifespan. The tagline should last multiple years because the underlying branding message shouldn't change at all. Whereas the slogan can change with every single campaign because different campaigns focus in on different points of difference and different values. So this allows the brand to test out different marketing approaches, to test out different messaging approaches to its audience and often really, really successful marketing campaigns and really, really successful slogans can be promoted to become taglines. And here are a couple of examples of that. Avis ran with a slogan, we try harder in 1962. Nike with a slogan, just do it in 1985. Apple with their slogan, think different in 1997. And McDonald's with I'm loving it in 2003. Each one of these iconic taglines started off as a slogan and later was promoted to a tagline on the back of the success of that campaign. So this shows how brands use taglines to define their market position, to own that market position, but they then use slogans to advance and evolve their brand. They test the market with different messages, they test the market with different angles, and successful campaigns often result in the brand not just evolving their tagline, but evolving their overall brand position. They go on to own much broader ideas on the back of successful brands. So the tagline and the slogan are two very distinct tools used for very distinct tasks within branding and marketing. So let me know in the comments below, where are you in your brand building escapades? Do you need a tagline for your branding activities? Do you need a slogan for your marketing activities? Do you understand now the fundamental difference between the two as strategic tools? And would you be able to go on and explain that to somebody else be it a client or a colleague let me know in the comments below if you like this video please give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button i'll do my best to answer all of the